Hello, my friends. <laughs> I don't know what the future holds, but I sure do know that God holds the future. Good morning, I'm Kelly Wright, and this is Hope in the Morning. God tells us that his plans for us are not for disaster, but for a future and a hope. And walking out here and hearing the birds sing in the background and watching the geese and ducks fly and seeing that spring is being sprung, that there are leaves and budding on the trees, I realize that life goes on and life unfolds. And sometimes life presents to us trouble. Because we love God, when trouble comes, we are not to live in fear or distress, but to realize that we are blessed. Now you can be blessed and go through stressful times, but God gives us the peace that surpasses all understanding. So let me share this with you, and hopefully you will share it with you, your families and your loved ones across social media. And let me encourage you to always pick up the phone and call your loved ones. And if you can't get them, leave a message. Let them know that you love them. It says in 2 Corinthians 4, chapter 8 through 9, we are hard pressed on every side, but not crushed, perplexed, but not in despair, persecuted, but not abandoned, struck down, but not destroyed. Therefore, we do not lose heart. Though outwardly it appears we are wasting away, yet inwardly we are being renewed day by day. Every day we will face challenges and certainly we are facing one right now. But God will help us be more than conquerors in overcoming COVID-19 and anything else. So let this be a time that unites us and not divide us. And the one thing that can cause us to have division is fear. So instead of spreading around fear, spread around the knowledge and wisdom that we're hearing from our health officials, our government leaders, and all of the experts who are really trying to help us. Pray for everyone involved in COVID-19. That means pray for you, pray for your family, pray for the medical professionals who are out there on the front lines, pray for the president, pray for world leaders, pray for everybody. I do mean everybody. And finally, my friends, keep spreading love, freedom, and peace. Not fear, but love, freedom, and peace.